Residents living in Kingwood have to battle congestion every day on a two-lane road that serves their community. The construction of sidewalks and more don't really help the cause. Councilmember Dave Martin said this presents a lot of challenges during rush hour. One of the challenges that we have, or the, probably the biggest challenge, is how do you move 80,000 people in the morning during rush hour to Interstate 69, Highway 59, to downtown, and then how do you get them back home in the afternoon? Houston's fastest growing zip code is 77044 in District E. How do you blend that with what people move to Kingwood for, and that is the trees, the serenity, the beauty, the walking paths, the bike paths, and a lot of the greenery. So the challenge we have is how do you blend in mobility with the lifestyle that everybody demands that Kingwood is all about. So what we're trying to do is to have a project that has four lanes of traffic, two on the north side, two on the south side, and to the problem they have is there's a big drainage ditch right in the middle of it. So what we're going to do is we're going to create six lanes of traffic, three on the north, three on the south, and hopefully that'll help us move people. The name of the project is called the North Park Expansion. All of the funds come from the city of Houston and other agencies. We have a number of sources. Uh, number one is the City of Houston Capital Improvement Project Plan, which the mayor allowed us to move funds that were dedicated from Kingwood Drive over to North Park Drive, but also the biggest part of this is we put together a mobility study in 2015 with the Tax Increment Reinvestment Zone, commonly referred to as the TERS, and a lot of the funding is coming from the city, the TERS, and also uh, a number of different agencies. We're trying to get TxDOT to participate because it is a part of the major thoroughfare plan. So the combination of a number of entities, city, TERS, and TxDOT, are the big leaders of the project. Perhaps the worst streets in Kingwood are North Park and Kingwood Drive. We're going to expand this project. We did a study back in 2015, as I mentioned, that dictated that we should do something to help mobility on specifically on two streets, Kingwood Drive and North Park Drive. Well, the challenge you have on Kingwood Drive is the beauty and the serenity of the panorama of trees that overlook that, that particular area. Then you contrast that with North Park Drive that has an ugly drainage ditch right in the middle of it. The issue that we have is a lot of that land, the first section of the land from uh, Highway 59, I-69, uh, to uh, probably about a, a mile back is owned by Montgomery County. So we had to work with Montgomery County to make sure that we had the ability to um, annex their street into the city, therefore we can use the funds from the city to address the mobility project. But I think when all is said and done, you're going to have uh, a huge, a huge improvement on what we see as the biggest issue in Kingwood, and that is mobility. According to Councilmember Martin, Kingwood is growing so fast that the Houston Independent School District will have to add more schools. The schools are scheduled to be completed by 2022. It is also estimated that at least 12,000 new homes will be built by 2025.